All right, welcome to the very first house I have finished, Brayden's Mansion. This is a wonderful sandstone house that I have created. Let's take a look inside. Inside, it completely changes form. Over here, well, this is obviously the main living room area. Over here we have a diamond couch, a remote, and a TV. Um, over here we have a basement. Of course, basements don't have to look nice, so... This is a redstone area for him because he is a redstoner. Um, now, if we go to over here, we will first see this lovely dining room I have created for him. These wonderful bar stool chairs that you can jump on top of. And then if we walk in here, we have the dining room with a lovely chicken on the table, and a nice chandelier, and a nice flower bed. And, oh, I almost forgot. If we come in here, we have some ladders. And we can ladder, oops, wrong spot. We can ladder our way up to the attic. And there's mostly junk in here. Like, none of them are actually filled yet because he has not moved in. And we can just come down and take the ladder with us. And that's it for the, for the dining room. Now, for the last room inside the house, we have Raiden's bedroom. With, we have nice vines on the walls and nice blue carpet. And don't you just love the bed? I, I love the bed. Um, and then in here we have his bathroom with coat, hang, coat hanger and a shower and my attempt at a mirror. yeah so that is it for inside his house but you still have to see his backyard all right you all ready here it is home sweet home you can follow the path either to lead you to the lovely campfire place area thing i don't know and then you can or you can turn back have a dip in the pool or the hot tub, which the path also leads to the hot tub as well. Right. And that is about it. Head on back inside. Come back to the front. And that concludes Braden's mansion.